<laughs> Where this fool go? He walked away. That fool snatched my phone and left. Test, test, test. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is obviously a little bit different. This is my fir not first time that I show my face, but uh, yeah, it's gonna be definitely new. But I guess the main topic about this today's video is gonna be just uh, you know looking at an issue of my car. Uh, recently, when was it? I think it was uh, Thursday, Thursday night, no Friday night, last night. My car, well, last yesterday morning actually, my car, the engine light came on, which was for the. Um, what was it called? The PCM module that I looked up. And also, I'm just having issues with the throttle body, the electronic throttle body control module thing, whatever. It's just messing up. So I'm just here at my brother's house. Just wanted to check it out, see what's wrong with it. Maybe something's dirty. I do have a pedal commander, which I might just take off. Uh, so we're just going to jump into it. Uh, I mean, let's just see how it is, honestly. But I guess first thing we're going to do is just, I mean, I spoke with one of my brothers-in-law or brother-in-law and he just said that maybe the air intake or the throttle body intake is a little bit dirty which i mean i mean i could kind of agree that it is a little bit dirty i see my air filter is super dirty which i gotta clean really soon and i should stop ignoring it but yeah i mean yeah last last video it was just me showing off my engine well my car what i've done you know what i'm planning doing uh yeah, it's going to be a little bit awkward, but <laughs> honestly, so I don't know. I mean, what, should we move the light here? Move it over so we can have light on the engine bay. And you guys can actually see. Sorry that we did or that we're recording this really late, but we're stuck talking with our other brother, which is pretty cool. I mean, it's fine. Uh, All right. But yeah. Have I don't you talked know. about the uh, the mods that you have right now? Or? I have, yeah. I have. Uh, Spoken about the mods I have, obviously the cold air intake, the catch can, uh, the engine coils that we have over here in the back, the orange ones. Uh, I mean, that is another note. I kind of have to, uh, re I guess, replace my spark plugs just because they are getting old. Yeah. Where's your screwdriver at, though? Bruh. Oh, that's right. I have it in the trunk. Low key. Hold on. Where we go get it? Where we get that real quick? Hold on. <laughs> So pretty cool electronic uh, screwdriver that we that I have. Don't mind the mess in the trunk. I have a lot Look of. Look at uh, this fool right here. Damn, I have such a mess, dude. Over here. Where is it at? Oh, here it is. Look at this. It's not a sponsorship. Yeah, I'm sponsoring nine thousand bucks to pay off this car, or else he's gonna lose a hundred thousand. All the money he's investing in this. Oh, yeah, 100000 <laughs> I don't know. He could have had a scat pack for the same price. <laughs> I mean, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. But, yeah, this is a screwdriver. All right, we're going back. We're going back over here with the throttle body. Damn, Danny. He took it, or Swiss, I should say. So we used to work at Monkey Monkey Garage. Say, go on. Monkey Garage? Who, who said that? Who said that works there? <laughs> nah. the All right. Let's see. Have you done this before? I have when I installed it before. <laughs> it's been a long time. I had to disconnect this uh, sensor here, but I don't remember how to do it. It's the, uh, the master air float sensor. Oh. Loki, I wish I had that one tool that I could take off things easily. But oh Jesus! Oh, there it is. And I could take this off. I might just move it, or should I just take off completely the no, intake? I think I think no, it should be fine. I mean, it could it could be the pipe as well that could be dirty. I don't know. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot of things that could be honestly. Well, like I've said before, this is this is all new to me, and I'm learning along the way. Ugh. Smells like oil. See that? See that oil? Oh, the the light. It is dirty, dude. Look at that. Yeah. See? 
So if you guys have a GT and if you guys have a an exhaust or intake like this, look, yeah. check this out. <laughs> you know, it's funny. I mean, when and that I'm, is with still with the catch can, huh? Yeah. And also, I mean, yeah, even with the catch can, it still spills oil. It's because of this right here, this uh, tubing right here. I think it's like the rebreather. The oil comes back into it and then it's like kind of sucks, you know? So I guess I'll put it in the grass. I don't know. Ah, uh, I mean, how else though? How else can I know if it's dirty? Uh, I'm a noob, dude. I don't even know what I'm doing, honestly. I need some, yeah. Let's check out what's going on in there. I mean, it could just be Open dirty. it up real quick. Open like it up. Like with your hand. Like push it. What? I gotta look inside here. Can you look inside? Uh, that's a good question. <laughs> I mean, it does look pretty dirty. I'm not going to lie. Hold on, let me get your phone real quick. The camera might not be able to. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> this is the first time we do this, okay? Yeah, that looks really black, dude. I'm not going to lie. That's weird. Even with the cash card. Yeah, I mean, I've installed it correctly. I All hope. All right. Let's go over to our... What's up? Oh, what you got here? You have the... What the heck? Okay, you put it... All right, so look, this is what we're using. The CRC Airflow Sensor Cleaner. Nice. Que perrito. All right. So how does this work since you've used it before? Just spray it. It's just a sprayer? I mean, uh, if you want to just spray it, and then you can also get a napkin or a shop. Oh. I don't even know. Oh, yeah, on top right a there. A shop napkin? There are some here. I, we got. We should probably go buy some. Low key, have uh, David take us to Sam's Club or something. <laughs> Hashtag uh, we're not sponsored by anything. So what? Uh, so it's just a, just a spray and then rub, I guess, like clean. I would say so. Yeah. Wait, inside it or just out the outside? Yeah, no, inside. Inside? Yeah. Uh, how am I, I supposed to rub much. it? How am I supposed to rub it inside? There's no way I see, can. You just clean it up a little bit. That sensor that's inside the uh, uh, intake, you should clean it too. Man, look how black that is. You've been putting 87 on this right here. Nah, nah, dude. Even though the manual <laughs> says it's 87, I don't do it. A lot of people would say, why don't I do 87? But I'll... I don't do 87. I do 91. Since we live here in Cali, it's not 93 or 92, which is kind of sad, but it'll, it's whatever. All right, well, hopefully this helps out. Yeah, this should be good. Uh, show, show, your, show the nephew real quick. Look at this fool eating ice cream. Look, look at the camera. You're going on YouTube with your mom's consent. <laughs> Let's see. I don't even know how else I could wash this or clean this. That's not gonna work. At least just to clean it off, you know? I mean, this is all part of maintenance in your car. That is the true. The perks of having a modded car. A project car? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, that's one thing I never knew about this, of doing this, cleaning it. I have failed on that part but hopefully everything goes good with my car i mean it's random because it's like last yesterday i was just driving to work and then i was like one block away from the, where i work at and then it just went off so i was like that doesn't make sense you know like it was so random about it wait ew look at it so much oil in there what the heck? What are you eating there? What kind of ice cream is it? It's Oreo. Oreo? It's just a cone? Ah. Okay. Alright. Oh crap. I close this down. 
I hope the audio is good. Honestly, guys, like, if there's any change. The new mics going. Yeah, we got new mics, finally. I have a, a volunteer cameraman. He's not getting paid yet, but maybe soon, once we uh, start making progress in this YouTube world, he, I could be, I could be paying him. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine if it changes. Alistair. But yeah, I don't know, man. If you want to talk about your car, what kind of car you drive, George? It's yeah. too soon. Too soon? Too soon. 2021 Challenger RT Scat Pack. Damn. Because it's not considered a quote-unquote <laughs> SRT. It's not, huh? It's not She's considered a SRT. She's a beauty. I mean, he says he wants to get oh, this car as fast or faster than my car, which I think it's possible. Hell yeah, it's possible. Damn, look at this. So dirty, bro. This is not even at the intake part. Freaking Alistair. This guy just wants to be on camera. He just want to be on camera, huh? Hold on. What are you doing now? Huh? What are you doing? Oh, snap. The fitting came off. All right. Ooh. This is just a boring part now. Yeah, it's all sticky, bro. I'm going to have to get more. Dude, that's dirty as hell. That is dirty as hell, dude. Look at that. I'm going to have to just get the roll over here. I'm not going to lie. But oh snap! There it goes, man down. But damn, bro. Mass airflow cleaning. If I finish this bottle, I'm I'll, I'll buy a new one, I guess. This guy. That's where it goes, man. Jesus. Super dirty. It's just oily, honestly. Like, like, what's the point of having a catch can if all this oil is gonna still go inside? You know, it doesn't make sense. But uh, I hope this fixes it. So I don't want to have to pay more money into something I could have just prevented. But all right, so I somewhat cleaned it. Cleaned the uh, throttle sensor control boy i feel like it might still be dirty but i don't know i mean if there's any tips from you guys uh leave it in the comments you know it'll be greatly appreciated as i am completely a noob and don't know what i'm doing half the time but i just enjoy doing what you know all about this i enjoy doing this it's fun and i want to continue you know and definitely make content out of it for you guys. So that way we can see where we go. Alright, let's put this back on now. So this goes here. Facing that way. And then this faces this way. But first, I'm going to connect it here. Bada beam, bada boom. Alright. Because right now, alright, so one thing. When I did move my car here, the engine light is on, but the air, the code for the uh, throttle response is not on. So it's like it, it's like it goes on and off every single time. So we'll just hope everything is good. Look at this. Jeez. Hopefully it's tight enough. This fool. The special guest right here, dog. It's the Swiss. All right, guys. Back in the days, we didn't have all this garbage, and our shits were way more horsepower and torque. I don't know what Dodge did, but Mopar kind of sucks now. Damn. But Everyone's going to hate. modifications make it better, though. I mean, yeah. I'm just hating. This shit is bad. Ah, there it is. It's bad. Like, it's not good. No bueno. <laughs> it's not Swiss approved. Nah, I, I haven't driven it. I lend, I lend him a scat pack, and he doesn't let me drive his car. Can you believe that? What? 
I never said that. He doesn't want me to know how whack it is. This guy. Scat pack or half cat? No, that's an easy one. Huh? Scat pack or half cat? No, I mean, uh, I don't know about a GT. Or... Wow, this guy. This is not a GT. This is a souped up GT. Souped up? I don't have a supercharger yet. Uh, I mean, I don't know. Mean that shit looks dope. It's both clean, man. Like on what? What are you, what, what on are you all talking your upgrades. about? On all of them? If I really add up everything, I think probably like around 4K. 4K? Yeah, 4K. What about uh, manpower? Like what would it cost to be able to install it? Uh, 2K? Probably, most likely. But I did everything myself, so that's why it's breaking. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's not really breaking. It's a nice car. I love the body. The body's nice. Like my scat pack. Wow. Of course. Yeah. I mean, it's a Charger, you know? Better than a Challenger, you know? Oh, yeah. <laughs> sure. There's Sorry, a mic. You want a mic? Challengers so are, um, are like for people that can't afford an Impala. <laughs> oh, they man, want a two-door car. <laughs> <laughs> Point the it's camera at him. No, I'm just kidding. It's a joke, man. We love oh, Impalas. God. We love Challengers. Oh, Challengers, geez. actually, I would prefer a Challenger. Yeah? Yeah, but I wouldn't have nobody ride with me. Uh, Only shotgun, that's it. No, yeah, definitely, I agree. But four-door cars are cool because they're four-door cars. Well, even then, dude, in this car, in the back seat, you're super tight. Like, if there's people in front, the I've back I've never seat been in the back. You want to sit down? Hell no. Oh, my no God. Way. Just take a little quick sit. Come hey, on. No way, bro. Wow. This fool. Cars are meant to be driven, not be driven in them. Well, what if you got to sit in it or, like, sleep in it? Well, I hope I'm never homeless. All right, all right. But I sat in the Charger, scat pack, oh, yeah? drove it like fucking 10,000 miles and slept oh, on yeah, it. Oh, yeah, true, huh? I forgot about that. So I driven it's definitely and slept uncomfortable. in the car. uncomfortable, yeah. It's not uncomfortable. Well, sleeping in the car. Like sleeping in a Charger, it is. Because I've done it before, and it's horrible. I could only sleep at the most an hour in it, but... <laughs> yeah, It makes looking. you want to drive. Yeah, that too, honestly. So... Cars are not for sleeping. Beds are. That's right. And if That's you're why broke, you'll so, uh, sofa surf. <laughs> sofa surf? Just ask a friend to crash at the sofa. That's or ask it. Georgie, hey, can I sleep in your sofa? All right. Or in hey, the garage. Bro, can I sleep in your sofa? <laughs> and tune in to uh, Georgie's text uh, coming in episode two pretty soon. Oh, yeah. That's right. We'll put it in the description down below, a link to his channel. So that way, if you guys but are interested. On the real, real, this car's pretty cool. I mean... It can do what my car could do, but it, it's a nice ass fucking car. Mm. I mean, at least, at least it's not la as loud as yours, so the cops don't really get attracted to it. Because yeah, <laughs> yours, Jesus. Yeah. It's pretty loud. Even the Challenger. Yeah, even the Challenger is loud. It's like, fuck. I mean, I've already, I've already showed your I car on my channel. I used to say those cars were fucking annoying. But now? But driving, you can't hear it. Yeah. Sounds nice though so from I'm, the inside. I might be pretty annoying driving, but, <laughs> but at least you're enjoying it's, it. It's That's not, the most it's important. It's not annoying to me. Exactly. Dude. That's the most important part. Yeah. As long as you I, like I miss car. driving horsepower, but it, my pocket doesn't miss it. Yeah. That's facts right there. 16 miles a gallon versus driving a hybrid 54 wow. miles. 54. Gallon. 54 miles a gallon. Damn. Yeah. I imagine the Tesla. Don't buy a 2.0 Honda Accord, man. It'll just give you 21 miles a gallon. Average. I mean, back so, in that time, man, that's pretty good. 2019. Yeah. No. My dad's was, he has a 2018. 2018. A 1.5 engine instead of the 2.0. And he gets like 31, 32 miles yeah. a gallon. I get 10 miles less. Because so you got a turbo in there. Nah, even that does have a they're turbo. All, they're all turbo. Yeah. All Honda Accord engines are turbo. That's true. Yeah. All right. But, um, but yeah, back to your showing us your car. <laughs> Yeah. Make sure you grease it up. I mean, I'm Have trying to one. keep it nice. Have All right, then, Swiss. I'm taking off. I'll see you. I'll see you next time. And if you guys need some, you know what? Let me know. Uh -huh. That's for you guys. <laughs> this guy. All right. We'll put a link in the description. This is like the sober as sober. Yes, sir. I'm clean. Good. All right. No, all right. This guy. All right, Danny. All right, then, Swiss. Where? Right. Right, I don't know if you want to show the the air filter. Which I didn't really show it last time, but it is super dirty. What's the best way to clean the air filter? You think? Uh, especially with this one, I have the uh, the filter cleaner. 
What? How do you even do it though? Cause can this bend down or no? No. Uh, I have the little thing to actually do it, but you know what we should sucks. buy? We should buy that one Milwaukee thing. The the light bar that goes from the the hood, like you know, like on, it clamps up on the hood, and it goes across the engine bay. That something like that would be badass. Yeah, some of them are like magnetic. Yeah, bro, like it's pretty cool. All right, let me take this off real quick. Damn, it's getting super dark, bro. This is horrible. No, it still looks good though here. Yeah, still looks bright. Can you still notice me, like my face? Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Okay. I mean, I guess that's the most important part. Okay, now. What is that? It's the screwdriver, bro. Show it off. Show it Line off real quick. Tech tools or what? Yeah, uh, I don't even know what brand this is. It's is from it Amazon. Cheetah, freaking Timu shit. Yeah, my coworker <laughs> gave it to me. It's pretty cool. You know, two-sided bits. It's got the flat head. It got the Phillip head. Automatic. Has a little light. Really, really. I mean, I never use it for work because I have it in my trunk. But it's uh, pretty nice and simple. So, yeah. So, I mean, damn, look how much oil that is. Look, look, show it. I mean, you can see it right there, the shiny. Yeah, a little bit. Put it more into the light, like face it this way. Yeah. It's not that bad, but. I'll... No, but the outside's dirty. Yeah, the outside's super dirty. So you just spray that and that's it? Huh? Or how do you clean the outside? Well, eventually you have to. Uh, yeah, so this guy here, the, the K&N, um, cool little product. Um, Hashtag not sponsored. But yeah, you could just <laughs> spray this here. I mean, the idea to, is to eventually wash it, but you could. Spray this. I spray from the uh, inside out. Oh, so like it shoots outward? Yeah. Okay, okay. Let's give this a try. I don't even know how, which way I'll I should do away it. away from the car. <laughs> Most likely, yeah, you're right. But I still want to be in the light, you know, because I don't want to be in the dark. We should buy spotlights next. Just that? Just spray it? I better get another shop bag or a rag to clean it. Because you could wash that like actual with water. And stuff. What? And then you can spray the oil? Yeah. Yeah, they do have the actual quote unquote cleaner from. Oh, shit. Yeah, technically, uh, they also have the cleaner. Yeah. Uh, this is just the oil, but they actually have the cleaner, but pretty much it's like a degreaser. Oh, so for okay, the price, okay. I think you're better off at just getting a degreaser. All right. That's good. Honestly, my dream would be getting a K&N fil air, air filter, but it's not legal here in Cali, dog. It sucks. JLT? It sucks, dude. The JLT has one too, no? For, for the uh, GT? I'm not even so sure, to be honest. It's only legal if you get caught. Exactly. And, uh, yeah, we don't plan on getting caught. <laughs> Except this is going on YouTube and we might get caught. <laughs> this guy. But, nah, I mean, I, I've looked it up. Because, uh, yeah. I plan on just shipping it to another state and having someone ship it over here. But in the other states, illegal as well. So, so when you meant when you meant cleaning it, you meant it in the inside or outside? You could do outside because the inside shouldn't be that dirty. But if you want to do an inside little quick one, like spray or just well, because you're gonna be taking off tonight, so you don't want to wash it because then you you could get water in there. And you don't want water. you you are right, but there's just a lot of dust here as well, which I'm uh just blow it out. <laughs> <laughs> I feel things fly back. That's nasty, bro. So dirty. Look how black it is. Look, I don't know if you guys noticed, but one side is red, like at an angle. And then, like, when you go to the dirty side, it gets blacker. Like, this side is the top side. So it's super black right here. It's like super dirty. A perro. A perro. Then it's a little me tricks. Ah, let's put it back on. Ah, yeah, yeah, man. This thing is intense, bro. Whoever let me get a modded car. <laughs> this is funny. 
funny but fun, you know? Like I always told my brother here, I mean, he should just get a, a boiler exhaust for his Challenger, but <laughs> he doesn't want to, dude. He doesn't want to get caught with it. No. He doesn't want to be catching any attentions or anyone's attention. All right, I think that's pretty tight for now. All right, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I don't know. What the hell am I saying? I don't know what I'm saying, guys. We kind of cleaned up everything. So we cleaned up the throttle body control a little bit. I hope it's a little bit better than before. The sensor, I cleaned in, the, the air sensor thingy. Damn, I don't even know the names. And I guess the next thing would just be changing spark plugs because obviously I am due to change spark plugs since I'm about to hit 50,000 miles with the car. And it's kind of recommended to do it like between 40 to 50, but also depends on how you drive. And quite frankly, I don't drive casual. <laughs> so uh, it's pretty uh, safe to say that they are pretty dirty, but we got to check that. But that'll be another video, honestly. But we're inside the car now. Uh, so I did say something about uh, a pedal commander here, which uh, the only reason why I feel like I should take it off is because this issue has happened before, I think like almost a year ago. My homie, he was driving it because I let him borrow the car to go to this one spot with his girl because they went to the mall. <laughs> all right, nothing happened. All right, all right. Not to put him on blast. But anyways, boy, he was driving home, a home, and the check engine light came on. And the same thing, the sensor, the sensor uh, PCM, well, the throttle body sensor came up also. So he was freaking out. He called me and he was like, yo, like, I don't know what's happening to your car, but the throttle got stuck. And he said he went to AutoZone. He got a check to set the PCM module. But what I had him do was to take off the pedal commander and just to bypass and connect it back how it is OEM. And it worked, you know? So the next day I was like, all right, sick. Let me just reconnect the pedal commander to see if the issue comes up and nothing happened. But now that it's happening again, I feel like I should just take it off completely. And I'm not saying that it's a bad product. It's fun, definitely, to have a faster uh, throttle response. But ultimately, I mean, I don't I never use it so it's like I might just have it just in case or maybe use it on a different car or just sell it but we'll see how it goes hey guys this is the dashboard uh yeah look at that check in You're recording I am recording oh. yeah I'll so this will buy like a $80 kit censored re no se que madres I don't know what it's a carly it's a bro it's a carly Timu. This was one of the, so you know how like in the, when you would turn, uh, sign up for Timu, you'll get like all these like, oh, 10 items free. So this is one of them. Yeah. Hey, it does the job though. <laughs> I mean, hey, yeah, it does, does the job, you know, which is uh, the most important part. Damn, the camera's going everywhere. I'm messing up anything. Oh. But yeah, I just kind of want to check what it is, honestly. New firmware up available. Let's press X on that. Probably just. Cut this out. <laughs> Doo -doo. Doo -doo. Cold fountains too. Monitors NA3. Cool. Read codes. So you have a throttle, pedal, position sensor, switch E, circuit, low. So it could be that. I feel like um, it is that. It could have been also too, you know how like our cars do um, those updates? Or like we get, so like if you're on the One Connect or whatever, or the Connect app. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, what was it called again? The Connect app? Yeah, well, now it's just called the Dodge app or something. Yeah, they but, took it off. Um, but I know every month it does like a scan on the car or whatever. So I think sometimes the, the Pedal Commander might have an issue. Might be restricting uh, a certain voltage maybe, back yeah. to the computer. And then That's true. When it does it, maybe, I don't know. Honestly, um, yeah. All right, well, all right, uh, that's one of the codes. So we have, uh, so like, check it out. Like, see, this was free, bro. Hold on. You got the P2138. <laughs> I got a guide. Throttle, it. pedal position, it sensor. It's way too bright. Oh, there it is. All right, cool. S switch D and E voltage correlation. So everything reads back to that the pedal. So for sure, man. <laughs> Honestly, see? yeah. This was about like Carly, no sé qué. I Carly, it's called Carly, not sponsored by the way. Let's just first before clearing the codes, let's go ahead and uh, just remove remove the pedal commander, turn off the car. All right, cool. All right, guys, we're gonna do a cut. Oh Jesus, dude, look, I don't even know how to take this off. 
<sighs> Where'd you go? What the fuck? Where'd you go? Did you say you're gonna get a drone shot? All right, guys. So I took off this pedal commander. Let me put this down. I should have put it down before. Uh, but yeah, I mean, honestly, guys, ultimately the pedal commander is fun. It's just a throttle response, uh, I guess, tune, quick tuning. A it's fun. fun. Mud, mod, I guess. It's a yeah, fun it, mod. it was fun when I first got it, but afterwards, after using it or after not using it for like two years, I was like, nah, now I'm just like, nah, you know, not really. I don't want to use it, but I mean, it's fun. It's fun. If you want to play with your friends, be like you modded your car, nothing, or say your car is stocked, and then I don't know where, you know, I don't know, uh, beat them on a race or something, you know, obviously in the track. It's fun, but yeah, that's about it. Hopefully nothing else happens to my car. Hopefully the engine light stays off this time. Hopefully by cleaning the throttle body and the air filter along with um, the tubing helps out. We'll find out until tomorrow. But if anything, I'll keep you guys posted, updated. Uh, I mean, I'll probably, I'll probably talk about it more on Instagram. So if you guys want to follow my Instagram, I'll leave a link on the description. And as always, I mean, if you guys like the video, uh, if you loved watching the video, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you're new. I'm trying to build up this channel so that way we could do more things to the car. Maybe in the future get a car, a motorcycle, anything fun. Drive around here in, um, in uh, California and I mean ultimately just live life, you know, on the fast lane. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, I'll keep you guys posted about this. Hi Draven. What's up little homie?